Daily Devotion with Pastor Bala for November 19th, 2022 from John chapter 15. Love from God. Previously, we heard that Christians are attached to Christ and will have the joy that comes from Christ. Today, Jesus also attaches the word love to this beautiful connection. So let's continue with John chapter 15, verse 12. This is my commandment, that you love one another as I have loved you. Greater love has no one than this, that someone lay down his life for his friends. So is Jesus implying that we should self-sacrifice ourselves for our friends, that is lay down our lives for our friends? Well, Jesus is going to be doing this when he dies on the cross for the forgiveness of our sins. Remember, Jesus is the ultimate fulfillment of love. Can we do this? Well, sure, but most of us won't. It's not a condition for us to get into heaven. But consider the men and women who serve in the law enforcement, fire protection, or the military, who do lay down their life for others as they serve other people. Verse 14, you are my friends if you do what I command you. No longer do I call you servants, for the servant does not know what his master is doing, but I have called you friends. For all that I have heard from my father, I have made known to you. And notice the change of relationship from servants to friends. So what's the difference? Well, the answer is faith. Consider what Jesus says about his friends, knowing that the master, who is the heavenly father, and what the master is doing. Not that we know all things from the heavenly father, but we know the salvation that God has given us through Jesus the Christ. This is God's plan of salvation, and we know it. Again, faith is the key here. So to, re to reject Jesus is to reject the heavenly father. So Jesus then continues, verse 16. You did not choose me, but I chose you and appointed you that you should go and bear fruit and that your fruit should abide so that whatever you ask the Father in my name, he may give it to you. Notice who is the active agent, who's doing the work here. This is God doing the work. God is the one who chose us. We do not go out and try to find God, but instead God is the one who takes on human flesh and blood and dwells among us. Christ Jesus comes to us and chooses us to be with God for eternity. Jesus continues, verse 17, These things I have commanded you, so that you will love one another. So we are to love one another. So consider it this way. God is love. So we first receive love from God when he chooses us and claims us as his own. We take what we have received from God, that love, that forgiveness, and we share it with other people. We take that love and forgiveness that God first loves us and we in turn love and forgive other people. That is that beautiful joy and love and forgiveness that comes from Christ. God's peace and many blessings be with you. And thank you for listening. And please take an opportunity to share this message with others. If you have enjoyed these daily devotions, please consider making a donation to Peace Lutheran Church, 24024 West Main Street, Plainfield, Illinois, 60544. Thank you again for listening.